Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how you can export your PNGs without any backdrop using Affinity Designer version 2. So here I am in the blank new document, I already put this star on it and now I would like to export that but without this white backdrop. So if you just head to file and hit export, you will see I got the whole artboard here. Even though I changed to PNG at the top, I can still see the white backdrop in my preview. So that's what causes trouble. And we're going to try to get rid of that. So one way is you can simply select only the subject. So only this star. And now I head to file again, export. And in that case, instead of exporting the artboard area, I change to selection only and here's my star without backdrop i'm exporting only selection and it will be safe without backdrop because this checkerboard indicating transparency so that's one way but what if you actually want to keep the size of the artboard right in that case let's change some document settings so if we head to our file document setup in the color section here there is a transparent backdrop and we can check this on after that you will lose the color for your artboard as you can see now it's completely transparent so if i try again right now file export artboard one as you can see there's no backdrop and you will have a nice transparent PNG. So that's the method number two when you wanna export the whole artboard, simply turn it into the transparent one. Actually, there's a whole persona called export persona. And in that case, you will be able to export multiple elements from your file. So let's go back here and draw one more element let's go for a hard shape huh all right now we got two elements i would turn on the color back all right so we can see it with actual color on our backdrop because by default your document will have a color all right so no transparency we got color back head to export persona and if i look into my slices take a look there's one with the backdrop there's also one without backdrop with both objects so that's nice what else can we do if you just select those objects we can create new slices for them so you can select create slice nice so now i got four different slices if you include this one at the top we can skip that and we can set them as PNGs and use, you will export them without any backdrop. So we can export three files, same time, take a look, export slices. And as you can see, I export those files without any backdrop as well using the export persona. So keep in mind, you can export only the selected area without backdrop you can actually switch off the backdrop for the whole artboard or you can use the export persona for that i hope today's video was helpful and for more tutorials check out the whole affinity designer playlist i hope i will see you in the next video bye